Hi, welcome to another episode of Hot Takes with me, the Silver Fox. Cameron Downing has been jailed for six years. He, of course, was the SNP activist. He liked getting his photograph taken with Nicola Sturgeon. And it is just one another of those coterie of people that hang around Sturgeon and the SNP who like to touch other people's children. They are a weird bunch. I say a lot that the P stands for something very, very bad in SNP. Predators, pervs and peds. And every week or every couple of weeks, we're having to do a story about yet another one. And here we are. Uh, this is a guy that wanted to batter and threatened to harm women who believed in standing up for their rights. Uh, he's been uh, prosecuted for sexual assault, for blackmail. All in all, exactly the sort of person that fits in nicely within the SNP's, uh, you know, sort of acceptable people bracket. Um, him, along with many, many others, they do like the touching of other people's children. Let's have a look to see why he preyed on these six victims in a little, very short period of time, it must be said, but felt he could get away with it because he was in the SNP. Here goes. So, SNP activist, pictured with Nicola Sturgeon, and who claimed he wanted to, wanted to batter turfs, is jailed for sexual assault and blackmail. There is a lot of it about in the SNP, and one only has to look. I mean, you can just randomly pick names. There's Kerr, Grady, you know, uh, Jordan Linden, and now Downing. And that's just a few. There are many. You go back, I've reported on so many times, these people have joined the SNP. And even the ones who haven't been caught doing anything, still have a very weird view. Just look at the First Minister, who, as Education Secretary, wanted and sent out the, uh, the, the form, he sent out the questionnaire, wanting to know what five-year-olds thought about when they were touching themselves. There's a lot of it, isn't there? It makes you wonder uh, why they haven't all been arrested. Oh, that's right, yeah, they own the police and they own the justice system. They're untouchable. They're above the law. It's amazing this guy has been given six years. I mean, really, in, in Scotland today, you can R a child and get a bit of litter picking. That's true story. Anyway, Cameron Downing, 24, preyed on six victims at locations across Scotland during the course of conduct, which began when he was just 16 years of age. And a prime, uh, a prime candidate for greatness in the SNP then. Former SNP activist who once tweeted how he wanted to beat the F out of feminists has been jailed for six years for a series of sexual assaults. Cameron Downing, 26, preyed on six victims at locations across Scotland during the course of conduct which began when he was just 16 years of age. The High Court in Edinburgh heard how the abuse continued until February 2023. Police learned about his activities and launched a probe, but the court heard that during the probe, officers discovered how Downing's repeatedly blackmailed one of the men he preyed on. Uh, because that's what yes, they, 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 these are exactly the sort of people that join the SNP a lot. We've seen it time and time again. They do like it, don't they? It's almost as though if you join the SNP, this behaviour is not just condoned; it's encouraged. Uh, he told the victim that if he didn't engage in sexual activity with him, he'd make an allegation to the police how he'd been raped by the man. The witness told the court that Downing said he'd also contact his friends, family, and employer to make these false allegations to them. The man, who is now age 22, gave evidence and said he felt trapped by Downing's threat. The correct procedure would, have batter, would be to batter Downing, but that's a different matter, isn't it? Uh, Downing, a former drama student and an equalities convener for the SNP London branch, so absolutely no use to anyone in any way, shape or form, not someone who's a benefit to society in any way, spent his trial denying any wrongdoing. The accused told the jury in his evidence that they ident he identified as being non-binary, which doesn't exist. Non-binary is what people who are ugly and unattractive call themselves so they can feel special. Uh, he said he'd been he hadn't been he had been threatening the male and was battling complex mental issues at the time of the abuse. Don't care. Don't care. Let's just hope that when you go into jail, you'll be battling uh, abuse of a different nature. Tell you what, you're going to have a lot of sex, let's be honest. 
Uh, last month, jurors spent two days deliberating their verdicts before returning guilty verdicts on charges of physical and sexual assaults on Downing, whose pronouns are he, they. I don't care. There are no such things as these pronouns. He's a man, and that's it. He's a weird, sexually abusive man, but a man nonetheless. Uh, on Tuesday, Downing of Willowbray in Edinburgh returned to the dock of the High Court in the Scottish capital for sentencing, and Judge Alison Sterling also ordered Downing to be supervised by the authorities for three years following his release from custody. He blew kisses to family members sitting in the public benches as security guards took him away from the court and locked him up in a small cell, unfortunately not for the rest of his strange, unnatural life. Passing sentence, the judge made reference to an interview that Downing gave to a court-appointed social worker tasked with finding out more about his background, and he told the social worker he was innocent of any wrongdoing. And the judge, she said, you have shown no compassion or insight on how your behaviour has affected the well-being of your victims. Your risk cannot be managed in the community, and custody is the only appropriate disposal. Well, there we go. Good, good. Now, he's this, this strange fella. He wants to bat turfs, apparently, because strong women frighten him. What does that tell you? Tiny cock and zero balls. Scared stiff of strong women. Ah, bless. And now you're going to jail. Oh boy, you're not going to make it. Anyway, I'll round that off. We'll come up and we'll finish the video. So there he is, a rather inadequate, tiny, bald little man who thinks that all he can do in life is beat women because that's all he's got. How sad. What a sad little existence when all you can think of is, I want to beat women because, you know, you don't beat a man because a man will fight back and probably batter the shit out of you. You sad little shart. And there he is hanging around with Nippy. Look, I'm with Nippy. Look, I'm in Darling Cranky. It's a shame you didn't start and practice on her, really, isn't it? But hey-ho, these things happen. What an inadequate... This is the trouble. These inadequates, they just think they're so important. They're not. They're worthless. They're shit on your boot. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. We'll round off there. Thank you very much for watching. Do please hit the subscribe button. Helps the channel. Hit the like button. Helps the video. And, uh, I, and let me know what you think down below. And I will speak to you later. Bye.